Every day we are faced with so many choices that we need to make. I'm sure you've already made a whole bunch of choices, like what side of the bed you decided to get up on, or which shoe you decided to put on first, whether or not you brushed your teeth. That shouldn't really be a choice. And a lot of the choices we make don't really make a big difference to our lives. But the point is, every single choice we make has a consequence. And so when Jesus was here on earth, he told a parable. That's a short story about the biggest and the most important choice we could ever make. The parable was about a bunch of fishermen that went out and they filled up their fishing nets with a whole bunch of different fish. And when they got back to shore, they separated the fish into the good fish that they kept and into the bad fish that they threw away. But what did this parable mean? What was Jesus trying to tell us? Jesus was trying to tell us that every choice we make has a consequence. So what are the consequences to the choice that we make? Well, we're either going to have eternity with God or we're going to be separated from God. But I, I don't want to be separated from God. I want to make the right choice. How do I know if I've made the right choice? What if I make a mistake? What if I don't get it right? But we can be calm because when Jesus came to earth, he came and he explained it to us and he made it so simple for us. When Jesus came, he said, I am the way, the truth and the life. And no one comes to the Father except through me. And so Jesus was telling us that when we choose him, we know that we will have eternity with him. And if we don't choose him, then we will be separated from him. But Jesus has made it so obvious. It is like neon signs pointing to him. You see, when we look at things like creation, we can see how amazing he is, how powerful he is, how he has authority over everything, and how he is telling us to choose him. When we hear the stories and the testimonies of what God has done in other people's lives, and we see how God takes care of us and the miracles that he does, he is telling us to choose him. When Jesus was here on earth, he came and he told so many parables, so many stories about choosing him. Just like the story of the parable about the fish, the good fish and the bad fish, and how God wants us to choose him and be like the good fish that are kept and not like the bad fish. And even more than that, when Jesus came, he died on the cross for us because he wanted us to be forgiven of our sins. He wanted us to be made righteous so that we could spend eternity in heaven with him. And so it's really easy. It's just about choosing Jesus, choosing to believe that he is God's son, choosing to believe that he was raised back to life, choosing his way instead of our own ways, choosing to do what he has asked us to do. It's so easy. And the choice is yours. So what choice will you make?